Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla. If you don't know me, then you're definitely not subscribed. So definitely subscribe down below. We're almost at 2,000 subscribers, which is crazy. It feels just like yesterday we were trying to hit 1,000 subscribers. And now here we are trying to hit 2,000. So it's so exciting. Here I am today to show you how I'm packing for an all-inclusive hotel that is coming up in about three days. I'm so excited. I'm going to Dominican and Republic for my senior trip with my family. So I'm going to bring you guys along with it. I'm going to be vlogging for about five-ish to six days. I think every single day I'm there I'm gonna be vlogging but I'm excited to show you guys what we're doing and everything that's gonna be happening there so definitely subscribe like I said because there's gonna be all that stuff going on when I'm in Dominican I made a packing video about a month ago about how um, traveling tips and things like that this more is gonna be like what I'm packing for Dominican not so much like the traveling tips and like things like that the video that I did like a month ago I honestly didn't feel so happy about it like I liked it I enjoyed it but it wasn't like my style so hopefully I can like redeem myself and really create a good video for you guys for this one so I'm not gonna keep talking I'm just gonna get right into it so the first thing that I do of course is pull out my suitcase I just got the best suitcase in the world like a couple days ago for my graduation Zach and Katie got um, a suitcase and a Polaroid camera for me for my graduation. So Zach got me this amazing suitcase. I love it. I wanted it for so long. I love to pull out my suitcase first because then I get to see like how much room I have for my suitcase and like how much clothing I can put in it and how much I can pack. This is a fairly big suitcase so I can pack a lot of stuff especially if it's going on this kind of trip because there's gonna be meals that I'm gonna have to pack nice and like but there's gonna be also times that I'm gonna like wanna be in just fun clothing. I call it like play clothing. And then there's also times that I'm just gonna wanna like look nice for no reason. Next thing I do is kind of weird. I don't know if a lot of other people do it, but I go on Pinterest and I look through ideas of like different packing ideas and like different things that I need to pack so that I make sure I get everything. Because the worst thing that could happen is when you get there and you find out that you forgot something that's like so important to your vacation and it's just, it kind of ruins it. Like this one time I forgot a hairbrush and like, it might sound really dumb, but it was when I went to Disney with the band. And so I had to borrow someone else's hairbrush for the entire week. And it just was a bad experience because I couldn't go out and buy myself a hairbrush randomly because I was with like so many other people. Definitely go on Pinterest and look at like some ideas and like some things that like so that you could bring along with you to your vacation. I need water. When I'm doing this, it also gets me motivated to look at some cute like picture ideas and photo ideas of where I am going to that place. It gets me motivated to like pack cute clothing and like pack different outfit ideas and things like that. The next thing I do is I make a packing list, which is so important guys. I kind of like briefly touched on it in the last like topic, but it is so important to have a packing list because if you don't have a packing list, then you definitely are going to forget like a complete like half of your list that you need and you can't forget half of your list like it is so important to pack everything what I like to do is make it really detailed and like nice looking so that it makes me want to like check it off and like look at it and like cross things off the next thing I do is go to my closet and I pick out a couple pieces of clothing that I can pair together to make an outfit if you make outfits it's a lot easier when you get to um, your destination and like have those outfits already picked out because if you just bring all these random pieces of clothing then it's just like you have all these random pieces of clothing floating everywhere and you don't really know what to wear all together also a good tip for this is that you pack like neutral colors so that they can fit with anything especially if you're not going to like take pictures or something like for me I go and I love to take pictures and like look nice the next thing that I do is I put all my clothing out in nice piles on my bed because I want to make sure and like count every individual thing that I have and like put them in like specific piles like cute t-shirts and like nice t-shirts and dresses and shoes and things like that okay guys so i just packed a lot of my clothing i put this all out in my bed because then i can see what i all have instead of just like stuffing in my suitcase and not knowing what i have but i have about four dresses because there's a lot of fancy meals there so just want to make sure i have enough dresses i have a nice shirt i also need to get one more but it's in the wash and then i also have a couple like play tees that I can wear and then these are ones that like are play tees but it's more for like working out and then also like 
sleeping. Over here I have some like tank tops and everything that I can wear with a couple different clothing pieces. So here I have a couple um, basic plain tees like I was talking about earlier about how to pack those. So always bring some workout clothes because there is a nice gym there so I want to like start working out there. I also have a couple basic um, shorts that I can wear. This is a romper that I got from American Eagle. It's really cute and I want to wear it when I go. So I thought it would be really cute to bring along. So I have some bathing suits that I want to bring. I also have to get the bottoms to these. They're downstairs. But then I brought this um, Hawaiian shirt because sometimes I bring Hawaiian shirts like when I'm away. The next thing I do, and I said this in my video from my travel hacks, I'll link it down below guys. Like I'm probably going to reference that a couple times in this video because there's some good hacks in there. But I roll my clothing every single time I go on vacation or like anywhere I go. It saves so much space. Also, it looks really satisfying when you have everything in your suitcase just like rolled up in a little like section. It just looks beautiful. that's gonna be it for the end of the video today guys thank you guys so much for watching definitely like I said before go down below and subscribe because I'm gonna be going to Dominican and honestly when you see this video I might already be in the Dominican but then that just gives you every more right to subscribe thank you guys for making it to this point also comment down below some of like your favorite travel destinations I love traveling and I want to hear where you guys have traveled before in the past so definitely do that or let me know like where you're going this summer so that's gonna be it for the end of the video thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in Dominican Republic bye